Hi everyone and welcome back to another video and um, we're looking at um, a new preview for custom shaders patch here. So Ilya's put out version, let me just check what it is, version 0.1.74 preview 33. Um, <clears throat> and there's quite a lot going on in here. Uh, so first of all, the um, CSP functions that add rain tire patterns has now been expanded and covers all cars. Uh, I haven't tested all cars, so I can't confirm that, but the ones I have tested it's worked with. Uh, one thing I have noticed on that though is if you watch back a replay, it doesn't always pull them through. That I did notice. Um, rain tire physics and the parameters around it have also been adjusted and fixed. And I have to say, when you're using extended physics with the rain now, um, it, it works really, really well. Um, you've got a lot more feel. The cars will aquaplane. You can sense where the grip is and isn't and it really does make a huge, huge difference. Um, the one thing that still isn't great um, and it's understandable why it isn't great is the fact that uh, if you whack on extended physics in the rain with the AI um, most of the time the AI is simply going to end up in the wall or off the track. Um, so basically it, it's an easy way to win a race because pretty much everybody retires but you um so that makes it interesting but you know it, but i can give it a pass on that in all honesty because a this is still being developed it's still being worked on and you know if you were to ask me is the rain physics that Ilya's brought with the csp as good as the rain physics you get with live track in um Project Cars or Kunos have brought to a set of course of competition, you know, the answer would have to be no, but with a very big but that this is one person working on this and what's happened here and what's been brought to, you know, plain vanilla Assetto Corsa with uh, CSP and Rain is quite frankly absolutely astonishing, you know, not just to get it working from a visual point of view, but to get it working as well as it does from a physics point of view as well, really is incredibly impressive. And I'm personally sure that, you know, that the AI will come to the party with this as well. We've already seen CSP bring improvements um, to the AI, so I see no reason why that can't happen. Uh, speaking of extended physics, um, they've now also refined um, some of the collision parameters so you're getting better collisions off the back of this as well and uh, oh, load times have improved quite significantly and there's been a, another physics tweak um, and this is one that you may have found yourself if you are driving on very large tracks. Um, AC has never really liked large tracks and the calculations around the force feedback would start to get um, a bit odd, so to speak. And um, what's done here, uh, what's happened here is Elia's effectively reworked the physics um, and swapped out the original ODE engine for, and it's an option, ODE complemented with double precision. So you you can go into uh, custom say, shaders patch, general patch settings, and there is an option in there to allow you to use um, double precision physics for this, and it certainly seems to have helped um, quite a bit in that regard. That is in testing. It's defaulted by uh, off by. Um, default for that reason and it won't work um, online just in case it gives us an advantage but you can enable it in the general settings tab of CSP as I say and um, overall it's another fine looking update from Elia on this and um, one of the reasons why I have no issue paying for the Patreon each month around this um, because it it's just adding and adding and adding constantly to um, a set of Corsa and you know what, what was a product that could well have just died on the vine um, has been given a huge new lease of life and a large part of that is down to CSP so there you go let me know what you think about this latest build down below um, and if you've enjoyed the video please do hit the like button and if you want to see more content of this type please do subscribe away to the channel and hit the bell icon to be notified when new content gets uploaded Thanks very much. Take care. Bye.